Hi guys, Retro Django here. Welcome back to my channel. For the last couple of days, I have tried to make a Doom work on my Amiga 1200. I tried it with a Blizzard card, I tried it with this ACA uh, 030 card, and the frame rates were pretty low. And I just love this community. I started with all this Amiga. Amiga passion last year and in the beginning I I just you know I talked with a couple of the guys here in Denmark there are like 10 or 20 collectors here in Denmark uh, real nice small community here but after making my YouTube channel it just exploded internationally and I just love the support I'm getting by you guys the support help your comments, your emails, your awesome suggestions. So I wanna say thank you guys, thank you for the support. I, I just, I love to be in touch with all you guys all over the world. It feels like my network is just exploded for the last six months and it's, it's just, it's great to be a part of that, you know, the biggest picture or bigger picture or what's it called. Now, today, someone of you guys told me <laughs> try a Doom on, just, let's just say Doom, try it on an 060. So we're gonna, we're gonna plug in one of my Mega 4000s and try to run it with an 060. But one of you guys wrote me something really, really interesting. Something that I have uh, never heard about before. So we're gonna we're gonna do that um, in a minute. He told me how to um, actually how to enable frames per second on screen. <laughs> um, so we're gonna do this together again. This is my Blizzard 030 with uh, 16 megs of RAM, of course, uh, two megs on the motherboard of the Mega 2000. So. He wrote to me on YouTube that I should click on this icon, the Doom icon here. Now, this is the first time I'm doing this, so if I do it the wrong way, please help me out. So he said, go into information. All right. <laughs> I didn't know nothing about this. So here you can uh, see some different stuff here. And here, as you can see, it says tool types. Can you read? Yes, you can read though. So he, he says that if these are on, then the command or what's it called is off. So as you can see down here, we have mouse and these are on. That means the mouse is not on, put on, on the game, connected on the game. Test priority, I don't know what that is. Joypad is not going. Here we go, music. So he writes to me on one of the comments that I should do something like this, remove them. And then if the music file or what's it called is included here, then the music should work now. Don't know, we're gonna test it. MMU is off. No sound effects is off. Here we go. Frames per second. That was what I was looking for. So if this helps, thank you, buddy. Thanks for the support. So now we just said that um, we remove these. So frames per second should be on the screen when we enter the game. I hope it works. So let's see, anything else? CPU, 60 at 040, it's off. Graphic card is off. EHB is off. Mouse ponder, checksum, force version. Okay, so let's save this one. And going to a Doom here, <laughs> Doom 2 on the 68030 with 16 megs of fast ram i hope i'm gonna get that frames per second on the screen guys don't know where but 
could be great. And music. So we're going to choose NTSC low resolution. Not this one, just this one. <laughs> and I hope, oh, wait, you can't see it there, but there we go. 11 frames per second. Oh yes, it works. Maybe we'll get the music also. No, no music. All right, so with <laughs> on the 320 by 200 NTSC low resolution with my O30, I'm getting three or four frames per second. Yeah, as you all know, that's just not playable. So let's uh, let's remove this one. I will take the SD card out of this one and put it in my Amiga 4000 with an 060. Let's take a sys test and then let's try this game, guys. All right, the Amiga 4000 is installed. I've tried Doom on my Amiga 1200 with this ACA board, the 68030, and as you also less than 10, 10 frames per second, so unplayable. Now on the Amiga 4000, you can have this 3640 or 40 processor that runs 25 megahertz. That's an option. You could buy the Amiga 4000 with this CPU. But over here, we have got the Cyberstorm 2. Now this one is really, really interesting because still it's an 040, just like this one. But this standard one from Commodore runs 25 megahertz this one runs 40 megahertz but that's not it of my knowledge you can have three different types of fast memory on the Amiga 4000 and without fast memory your Amiga is just not that fun so the first kind of fast memory on the Amiga 4000 is on board on the motherboard and you can have two mix of chip RAM and 16 megabytes of fast RAM. Now this, this is great, this is standard, easy to upgrade. It takes four megabyte RAMs, uh, 16 in total. The next type of memory expansion is something like this on the Zorro 3 expansion port. Now here I have got 16 megs of RAM. Oh. 64, I'm so sorry. This Zorro 3 uh, board has got 64 megs of RAM and, and SCSI controller. Now, in the beginning, I was just in love with these boards, but RAM expansion like this is not something I will recommend because they're just so slow. <laughs> really, really slow this way. And the third type of RAM is something like this. I mean, the difference between this O40 and this one is just like night and day. On this one, Cyberstorm MK2, as you can see, it's got 128 megs of RAM and those RAM are directly on board on the CPU card. And that's just so fast access to the RAM, it's, it's amazing. I love it this way. So both O40, but having the onboard RAM here, fast RAM, it's amazing, guys. So I got the Cyber Vision cards, but my knowledge is just, I know nothing about them. So that must, we can try that another day. <laughs> but on this Amiga 4000, I have installed another Cyberstorm MK2, but this one runs with the 68060, just like you asked me on all the on, on the two videos, guys. So we got 060 processor here, not overclocked, no nothing, runs 50 megahertz, and it has got, I don't remember how much fast RAM, but again, onboard fast RAM, so this, it's gonna be a kick-ass system. The 16 gigabyte Scandis, Sandisk card is the same card. I took it off my Amiga 1200 
and put it in here. So let's just give this one some power and see how it goes. Okay, I just turned the Amiga 4000 on. I have a fan here that pushes in some cold air on the RAM, also fan on the CPU. So I just let's let's keep all the parts cold, guys. So that's why I have a fan down here. So let's just first start with sys info and see how this how this Amiga performs. So just um, a quick one over here. Sys info. I've been told by you guys some of my videos are just too long, making. 40, 50 minutes videos, one hour videos. I have to shut them down. So we're gonna do everything quick. I'm not gonna talk that much. We're just gonna power this one through. So this one, as you can see, if you go back to this, I tried Doom on my Amiga 1200 part one and two, it scored 9,500 dry stones. Here we have 37,000 dry stones and it scored 9.5 MIPS and here we have 39.7 MIPS so much much faster and it's again 060 and the oh sorry I should check the memory <laughs> let's see drive speed if it's still 2 MIPS per second Yeah, 2.4, just like my Amiga 1200. It's the speed also. All right. And the memory we have on board, on the CPU board. Now, th this is just, this is perfect. So, after I've tried these Cyberstorm cards, I'm, I don't use my time with the normal, you know, 680, 60, I mean, these boards with onboard memory, they're just so fast i love them so we have 128 makes a fast ram on board and we have 16 makes a fast ram on the motherboard and two megabytes of chip ram nice everything looks nice and ready to go so let's try let's try doom now i'm anxious to see if it scores 35 frames per second that could be great guys so let's see how it goes and again I'm gonna choose the lowest resolution I can choose and again thank you for all your help and support guys it's great we're scoring 70 frames 17 18 frames per second that's still just so low guys <laughs> It feels like it's playable now. Nine for oh, there we go. Still, I can't shoot and and turn. It's odd. It feels like it. Okay, I'm shooting now, and I'm. Can I walk? I can't do nothing while shooting. I mean, you can't play Doom like this. Shoot and stay still. <laughs> I, E, K, F, A. Yeah. I can run fast. And I can turn while running. Okay. I mean, it is playable. Please look at the frame rate at the top right corner. It is playable, but still, it's not 30 fr 35 frames per second. And this uh, non-turning while shooting is just not. So it's something. Maybe it's something with my configuration on my Mega. I don't know. Uh, but I'm shooting, and I can I can do nothing. How about running forward and shooting? Yeah, turn. <laughs> yeah all right guys let's conclude this one that 
I'm a bit disappointed. <laughs> Some of you guys write to me that I should try something called Attack Doom. Let's do that. I, I don't have Attack Doom. I just I recently got hold of this A Doom. I'm not the kind of guy that goes online with my Amiga and any what what are those? I don't know those places where you download stuff. I uh, I'm a WSD load gamer and I enjoy it, <laughs> uh, but. Still on an 060, and I think it runs 50 megahertz. I'm not sure. Let's let's check it out. Let's check it out um, if it's the O. I think it was 50 megahertz, and still under 20 frames per second. It is playable, but not enjoyable. <laughs> Again, I, I I am a bit disappointed, guys. Let me see here what, what it says with which Amiga. How many megahertz? Are, yeah, 060, 50 megahertz. This is how it runs, guys. It's with Kickstart 3.1. Yeah. And again, <laughs> with the 060, most of my WST dot games, they just don't work. So I have to pull that 060 out and insert an 030 in an Amiga 4000. It, it feels so... <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean. Um... Power assault. Let's just load this one. Let's see how it goes with the 060. <laughs> Three fans. It's it's pretty noisy now. <laughs> oh, nice. It works, but uh, it, it can run faster. Or I mean, in deck there can be so much stuff. Press fire. My joystick is somewhere, somewhere, yeah. So, here we go, guys. I'm listening to uh, what you're saying. You all said, that, not you all, some of you guys said I should try it with the 060. Well, this is my 060 CPU, Cyberstorm, with 128 megs of fast RAM, running 50 megahertz. Now, if you write that I should overclock my 060, then I will say no. <laughs> I'm not gonna risk anything. I love this. Uh, I love this board. I'm, ju I'm just gonna keep it with the 50 megahertz and running with the normal fan that I got with this one. So I'm not gonna do something like that. Some of you guys said try attack doom. It's optimized much better. It will run better. We could do that. But I'm just loving this idea with this help that I got from you guys with the frame rates and all that it's its a really nice way to test it on so um, yeah I will just conclude this trying a doom on Amiga series with this video for now I want to say thank you for watching thank you for all your support all your comments I love you guys I love doing this I love the huge community I'm a part of I wish you all a great great day until next time click up some of my other videos guys and share some of them i have just made an account on twitter <laughs> find me in there i don't know nothing about it but I, I, I just made it so now i'm a part of that one too so many of you guys said make an account in there so i just did it <laughs> don't know nothing about it I found Arnold Schwarzenegger in there. I'm following him. So, yeah. <laughs> Have a nice day, guys. Bye.